Don't have a box Here's how you make a box. So we're going to run through this pretty quickly. So first you need your boxes, the basic tools. You need a cutter. There's a cutter. Mm -hmm. You cut on the long axis of the box. You cut a little square out up here on the top. A little square on yeah, the top. Yeah, so see how like easy that? that comes out. See, not less than, like a, less than about an inch. So that's not just your viewing hole, though. No, no, that's actually where you're going to uh, let the sun in. So, and then you got to make, this is actually, you can use aluminum foil, but I found that this holds up a little better. Just take a pop can, cut it, which I find also very much dulls your cutter, and then you're all screwed. But before we do that, we have to have our pinhole. So to do that, put it down there on the box, and we take a thumbtack, and we punch it and there's our there's our pinhole just like that just like that okay and uh, this is probably the most challenging thing working with do you want me to pull this stuff off for yeah, you and then why don't you can, we do that uh, yeah because this is this, where the tag team effort exactly this was the hardest part of the whole job actually <laughs> as i was saying you proved my point there we go all right the, over the, the whole thing uh no just along the sides just of it yeah you want to keep that hole totally clear all right just like that if i put the tape on the right side oh, there's that too it's stickier uh, I've noticed that. <laughs> so, and then on the other side. Normally, you do all four corners, but and for the this demonstration, so we can get through it very quickly. Okay. Okay. Like now that. we need to put some a viewing area, which is going to be on that. And oh, look, there's already a piece of paper in there. How all right. So we put so, paper right down there. So just tape that guy on there. Okay. And now let's see if we can actually get it to work. And all right. And that's it. And that's all there is to it. And then. The instructions for using it are pretty easy. You simply pick it up, you put your back to the sun, and put it over your head, and aim it. Now, since we're not quite at eclipse day, we have an artificial sun right up here, and this Ben is, is gonna play sun. the role of the moon, and that is a very, very bright light. I will just tell you that. So, <laughs> okay, so let's see. let's see if we can position this the right way. And if we can position it so that Tim can get a shot there. Let's see if we can get in there, Tim. Is it possible? We're not getting this. The, oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think we got to up, 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 up. There it is. There we go. Okay. Why is that so hard to get to this time? Okay. And there we go. Let's see if we can. Let's see if we do an eclipse. There's the eclipse. Well, it's not the best. It's not the best. It's not the best. Well, the better, we have a better one there that's you go. You pre made, it. and we actually were able to see the eclipse. But you, you can do this in a number of different ways. And actually, I put instructions on king5.com on how to make an eclipse viewing box. So you can go there to get a little bit more organized look at that. But it's a great, it's a great uh, way to watch the eclipse on Monday safely.